hi dear students and friends welcome again to the excel video tutorials uh, in this video tutorial uh, we will learn the h lookup table uh, and uh, for this particular task uh, we have an example uh, here uh, in the example we have students and their marks so we will use the h lookup tool uh, through which we will assign grades to the students as well as remarks uh, also we will see the maximum marks minimum marks average marks as well as standard deviations uh, in the addition we will also see that uh, the number of students who have uh, secured grade a b plus b c plus c d plus d and finally f grades uh, starting the tutorial here uh, uh, we have a table in the table here in the column uh, in the row 14 here you can see in the row 14 uh, the numbers are that is numbers or marks are given here so from 0 to 100 uh, these are the marks and uh, in the 15 number row here you can see that these are the grades as well as in the 15 and in the 16 row you can see the remarks according to their marks and grades uh, so i want to uh, make a grade sheet for the students uh, i need uh, the uh, of a tool or the formula which here i will use that is i want to uh, to calculate the grades for all of the students so i am unable to add manually the grades for e each and every students it's a very tedious work so here you can see that i have made a table as well as marks and remarks um, now i need a formula here in this cell i will write a formula uh, for the purpose of uh, grades so here i will write equal to and uh, h look up and here uh, you can see that the h lookup value so i will write here I will, the value or i will click the cell which i want to calculate so here this is the cell which should be added here that is h9 now i will write a comma now it says me to select the table array so for the table array i will select all this table starting from uh this zero to the final point that is genius now uh, i will need the columns as well as the rows to be constant so writing here the dollar sign in the uh, for the column as well as for the row again for the column as well as for the row now i fixed this array uh, now i want to add here a uh, row index so which row you want to be added in this column so i want to add the column number f uh, sorry uh, the 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 row number 15 uh, so i will write here that is column number one as uh, so row number one and that is row number two so i will write here two and again i will click comma now i will click this one that is true approximate match double click it and now break it closed enter so you can see that the students who have secured marks in the range of these for example that is the 71 marks so he will get the grade b so the grade b lies in between 70 and 77 so uh, dragging it or clicking double on the corner of the cell it gave me automatically the grades for each student now i want to re add remarks also so for the students who have secured zero marks that will be considered f grade and 
uh, he will would have been uh, he would be awarded the uh, the remarks uh, to him uh, like badly failed and if a student uh, who have secured 100 marks uh, will be the remarks i will give uh, him genius anything you can add here uh, now i want to add the remarks for every students depending upon their marks so you can see here that the same table would be used for this particular task i use the same uh, uh, the same way which i have used for the uh, grades calculation now copying the cell control c and control v now you can see that uh, here are some error but i don't need this one so bringing it again backwards and uh, now i need the column sorry the row number three which are remarks now here remove two and write three now the third row will be counted now enter so here you can see that the the marks that are 71 so 71 uh 70 to 76 the grade is uh the the remarks will be very good now dragging it down you can see that uh, best for example a student uh, whose remarks are best so his grade is b plus and marks are 79 so best okay this is done now i want to uh, see the maximum marks minimum marks average and standard deviation in their result so for this purpose i need the formula which is equal to ma x max and selecting this column so control shift scroll down enter you can see 89 is the maximum marks again uh, the minimum marks equal to min minimum starting again now selecting this one and shift down and enter zero are the minimum marks and average so for the average i need equal to a v e r average double clicking and now selecting the column again and enter so 64.62 is the average marks and equal to standard deviation that is standard deviation for form this one dot p population selecting this column again and click entering so this is the standard deviation of the marks now i want to calculate the number of grades a students have um, uh, the number of students who have secured these grades so here i need a formula which is equal to count f count f the range so this is the range i want to give it the range control shift page down so this is the range now i want to add a criteria so the criteria will be com comma that is a grade so a and enter but keep one thing in mind i'm just leaving it same now i want to show you one thing now enter now you will see that all the the, the grades will be three three or and finally this one is two what is the reason that here are two and uh, here are also three so the thing which i want to show here uh, like count f the column uh, the first row is missed and uh, the second row started for this column uh, for the b, b grade and here the for the the b it will come down two points and finally for f i want to see now you can see that these are lifted so uh, to keep all the column selected what i need i will select the column uh, the this one again and i will write the dollar sign for keeping gas fixed so now again and enter now the column will be and the rows will be fixed now if i will enter this one 
the starting point will be column uh, so row number nine now i want to change some of the things uh, which are here that is this one is b plus so i need here b plus the other one is b here that is b the, this one is c plus so i will change here c plus okay i have made some mistake this one be will be c plus and this one is c the other one is d plus this one is d and the final one is f now you can see 50 students have secured b grade now i don't need any uh, manual calculation to find uh, the number of grades now you can see 50 students have secured b grade uh, now i want to calculate the total grades so equal to sum and selecting this column and clicking enter so there are 108 students who have secured these kinds of grades hope you got this video tutorial uh, we'll see you in next video tutorial